Hello and welcome to a story about my uncle. I am Junior, and this isn't really about my uncle, but as far as I know, this is a game where I'm running around this alternate reality, I, I, I don't know. And I do know it's by the same people who made Goat Simulator, so I'm curious to see if this is a, um, a, uh, a, 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 a physics sandbox like that was. Um, I don't know why continue is an option. I haven't even gone new game yet, so let's do it. Overwrite the previous save of nothing? Sure. I'm okay with that. Dad? Aren't you sleeping yet? It's time for bed, honey. Dad, I can't sleep. Can you tell me a bedtime story? All right. What do you want to hear? Something... something about an adventure. Hmm... I think I know just the thing. When I was your age, my biggest dream was to follow my Uncle Fred on one of his adventures around the world. One day, he disappeared. Interesting. I stepped right. into the lobby of my uncle's house. It lay just across the hill from where I lived with my mother your grandmother. She had tried to keep me from going, but I wanted to see, see if Fred was home yet from his latest adventure. Oh good, I have telescope eyes. Well, that's comforting to walk in on. Um, he certainly is an adventurous type of man. Daddy's helmet. Like, a big daddy? I don't know. That's what I'm going to assume. Mr. My Bubbles. uncle used to send me postcards from his long journeys. Greetings from Nepal, Galapagos, Kilimanjaro, the Amazon River. This was the first time he had left without a word, without sending cards. Interesting. I assume I'll figure out why. Oh, well, that's really nice outside. Why would I go over to my uncle's house in what appears to be a late evening? I had visited Uncle Fred's house countless of times. But in the locker, which usually was closed, I found something I hadn't seen before. It was an adventure suit. It resembled the one that Fred used, but smaller in size. Was it built for me? Curiosity got the better of me, and I tried it on. It fit like it had been custom made for me. Well, apparently it was built for me. Interesting. Um. Yes, I totally understand all of that on that blueprint right there about the grappling hook. The most mysterious room of my uncle's house was the observatory. There he kept his newest experiments, and right now it held a pad used for disposing of garbage. Uncle Fred had warned me not to touch any of his things, but as I said, I was a curious child. <laughs> Welcome to Fred 05 version 0 0.03. Pull the lever to launch. So th this is a trash disposal unit. Okay. Hmm, whoa. Well, I guess I'm being pulled in. Does it think I'm trash?
My uncle's name is actually Brett, so... Well, I also have Al. Joe. I ended with a crash, but thanks to the suit I wasn't hurt. I had no idea where what? the pad had taken me, but back then, I didn't care so much about where I was going, or how I would get home. Well, he was definitely using it for trash, but I was gonna... I was gonna try and zoom in, but instead of uh, zooming in, I just jump now. Oh good, I can sprint. Thank you, I just figured it out. Nice. You know, he probably demonstrated it as a, uh... The suit protected me from falls on the ground, but not in water. I couldn't swim with this thing on. Best be careful. Whoa, hello. Probably uh, showing it off to people as a uh, trash disposal, so we'd probably use... Some trash. Yep, I actually already learned that. Thank you very much. Accidentally, albeit, but still I learned it. I was sure that someone had been here before me. Someone had built these bridges and carved these symbols, but who? Where were they now? I suppose that is something that was, uh... Power leap. Okay. That was a question I should have asked, because, you know, random area, I'm assuming, uh, off-world planet. Oh, that's cool. I found a strange gizmo, some sort of measuring tool that Fred must have built. It seemed to be done measuring, though, so I took the results to give to Fred. Oh, I just noticed butterflies. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. I'm very much definitely in another world of sorts. I don't need to be doing that leap, but hey, it's what I do. Uh, that way looks like progress. I wa I'm curious on seeing what's over here. Well, I missed the jump. There we go. Oh. How did you know Fred had been there? Well, I found a small campsite where Fred must have slept before going further into the caves. I knew it was him because the place was littered with empty packages of his favorite hiking foods. Canned soups, tube food, and instant noodles. Tube food? That sounds gross. Oh well, it's not that bad. One winter, Uncle Fred and I went hiking into the mountains, and we were surprised by a blizzard. We were stuck in a small cabin for two days, and all we ate was tube food, and cold canned goulash as well. Your grandmother was worried sick. But I thought it was all very exciting. Of course you would. <laughs> You'd like to go on adventures. So I will say one thing. I did not expect this to be uh, this great looking and run so beautifully. Because <laughs> the only thing I know Coffee Stain Studios from is Goat Simulator. Uh, the narrator, I, said that this thing protected me from the ground, so... I can long fall. Great. Did that save? I forgot to see. Uh, it doesn't look like anything important down there. Oh, what's this? The power core I found activated the suit's grappling device when I picked it up. It must have been left here by my uncle. I can see how to tell when that is something I can grab. And it doesn't look like it's just based on the symbol on the rock. I 
it'll just light up every time I have the ability to grapple. Well, it's almost like I called that. Epic. The grappling device left a sort of symbol everywhere I grappled. I noticed similar symbols already there in the cave. And I was getting more and more certain that this place was where Fred had gone. Mm, the pacing of the narration could be a little higher, but that's just me. And I was literally about to say something about the symbols I was making compared to what was already there. Ah, I see how that's going to assist me in my... Well, shit. That's going to assist me in my little... adventure to see where Fred has grappled before I have. I see a little alcove. Haha! Okay. Strange. Oh, I did catch that. I am so glad I caught that. I thought I missed. But I'm getting, uh... Getting collectibles, so that's awesome. Not sure how they're going to help me. Yeah, it... The adventure suit was fantastic. By combining a power leap with a grapple, I could fly long distances through the air at great speed. I was going to say, that looks like a secret, but that's literally where I just came in from. Excellent. So... I'm loving it. Let's see, I'm gonna stop right here for a moment and just... admire it, really. Because this is a beautiful game so far. Uh, the physics are really nice. And, like I said, it is something I absolutely did not expect from Coffee Stain. And then I did that. Okay. Not sure why I didn't expect something like this. Maybe because I didn't have any sort of a data pool to pull from. How would I know? But I... I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of lost for words. It's one of those things that... Not necessarily expected, but quite pleasant. Grappling a moving object, I'll follow along. Fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Let's, let me see. Come back. That's what I get for not paying attention to life. First the camera falls over, and then I lose my rock. Beautiful. And I noticed that the uh, charge is counted on my hand how many times I'm assuming I'm allowed to grapple. And I also noticed that it charges every time I hit the ground. So that's a benefit. Oh man. It's an obstacle course of pure skill. Skill. And I feel as though I have that skill for once. Granted, I've died twice. Or, th or thrice. I don't know, I haven't counted. Yeah, baby. Absolutely beautiful. Ooh.
I don't know. Oh, yep, yes, I made it. Perfect. I do like that, that the uh, reticule is the same as the uh, symbol I'm putting out. Oh, I didn't have to do that, but I did. Ooh, another power cell. Grapple two times before landing. Beautiful. Yep, I called that as well. The lit thing indicates. So, what? What? The fruit flies are gone, but now I've got a mosquito. I feel like there's probably secrets at the top of this. Apparently I was wrong. Yep, I was wrong. Still though, a mosquito. Oh, come on, make it. Oop! That's not what I wanted to do. Why did I do a leap? I wanted to jump, not a leap. Hello, you seem out of place there. Well, this is another game that gives me a good feeling of, uh, Absolute freedom, kind of like, uh, Valley. I, uh... I recovered. Perfect. <laughs> oh, yes, this is fun. I know what I'm doing. I swear. Actually, I have no idea what I'm doing. Oh, that's two and E. That was not W and D. Another campsite? Did you ever see any of Fred's experiments yourself? Yes. I actually helped him collect samples for his research sometimes. To learn about them? That's right. We found all sorts of things. One time, we went to the forest and found a small pool of water that was full of eggs. Eggs? Were there chickens in the forest? No, not chicken eggs. These were small and jelly-like. Hundreds of them. Fred told me that they were frog eggs. He was in for a surprise, though. Guess what happened? What? What happened? Well, we took some eggs back home, and one day, Fred woke up with bites all over his body. Turns out, it wasn't frog eggs after all. It was mosquito eggs. Ah, oh, poor Fred. I know. He did find real frog eggs eventually. He told me that they were very, very special. But I don't know what happened to them. Interesting, I just happened to talk about mosquitoes. Well, a mosquito. I don't know where he went. Technically, actually, it would be a she. Perhaps this game has a little too much hand-holding when it comes to the symbols guiding me around. String lights. Oh, I accidentally just clicked. That's not what I wanted to do. I need to click and hold. That's 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 what I wanted to do to get on there. There we go. 
<laughs> yep, that's exactly where I clicked. Oh my god. Why have I done that? Why? I never said I was a genius. Actually, I, I, I don't think I even said it. Damn it, I did it again! Why did I double click? I did never say I was a genius. I never even said I was smart. Oh, two symbols showed up for that one. Curious. But, um. Hmm. These blue lights. Did Fred put them here? Or was somebody else here as well? I... I mentioned the string lights. There's some sort of party going on. And there's electricity flowing through this area, which seems to be all... Uh, caverns and waterfalls and floating rocks, which is really cool. I do like the style of this game so far. I might I might do a couple parts on it, but I might not. I don't know. I, I'll find out. Hmm. But yeah, this to me, this is totally unexpected from Coffee Stain Studios. But it's also my bias, because the only game I know them other than this is from Goat Simulator. And that was... That was absolutely over-the-top hilarious. That was good. Maybe I'll do Goat Simulator on the channel someday. Probably not, though. Anyways, I want to thank you for giving me your time of day so I can throw it out that window over there. And if you liked this video for some reason, hit that like button and why not subscribe? What's the worst that could happen? Anyways, thank you, and I hope all of you have a wonderful day. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. If you want to see Wednesday's video, click right over there. And if you want to see what YouTube thinks you like, click right over there. In the meantime, I'm going to go make myself a sandwich.